Okay, so for usual, I'm on the way home, but I had a really interesting conversation with uh, I had a really interesting conversation with a friend of mine, and they were telling me that you know, like. Cause you know, like the slow transition to America's cool, and all, and they're like, "Yeah, your music's like your music's cool, but it's all over the place. Like, what's your identity? What's your story? You know, and and for those of you guys who've been around since like the beginning of the whole Age Project thing or whatever that we did uh, last year, um, The whole project was about finding an identity, right? The whole project was about finding out what kind of music I liked. And you know what I realized? I think I really grinded hard last year. Like I, I worked I worked my ass off. Let's let's be honest. Like I, I really feel like I did the best of my ability to get the best results that I could. I don't know if I got the best results, but I'm satisfied with with where I where I ended up, right? After that whole project. And I'm sitting here listening to that question and I'm still hearing <laughs> who are you as a person and I still don't know isn't that sad like I I I still don't know who I am it's so weird it's such an easy question it's such an easy question <laughs> who are you what is your identity what's your story what kind of music do you like? I don't know. I think I think it's cause okay, so here's my thing, right? I think it's cause you're doing amazing. I appreciate that. I appreciate all the words of encouragement. Um I kinda just came on to like talk today. I'm I'm not really here to like hear encouragement and all that. I just I just wanna have a conversation with you guys. Like, do you do you know who you are? I, I don't know who I am. Like, I, I legitimately don't know what I like to do. I legitimately don't know. Like, I can't tell if I like music anymore because, because it gets, it garners me respect and validation or if it, if I genuinely like music. Or because I just like music maybe because I'm like I feel like I'm adequate at it like I'm good at it that's such a hard question is it like let's say you have really good grades right do you like music or do you like studying because it gets you good grades and respect from your parents or does it Taehyung is what is it? what is it? what is it? That's, that's so hard. It's such a hard question, isn't it? Do you enjoy music? I think I do. I think I enjoy music. I'm pretty sure. You know what I mean? But like, even with that next question... Even, even with the next question, like... What's your story? I'm tired of that. I've been doing that for the past 10 years of my life. What's your story? I got the K-pop star. What's your story? Oh, you're the kid from California with the guitar. Oh, and then I went to JY and then what's your story? Oh, um, you're you're the you're the foreigner who has a hard time understanding Korean, but the pronunciation is really good. Like, oh, what's your story now? Oh, you're you're part of Day Six, the band who's uh who's you know one of the rising bands in Korea. Okay, fast forward three years later. What's your story now? Oh, you're you're the best-selling band, or whatever. You know what I mean? Like, I've been doing that for so long. Why do I have to have a story, bro? Why can't I just be me? Why can't I just be like? Why do I always have to act like someone else? Like, for example. Like, Real J wants to talk back a lot. But a lot of people are like, well, that's not allowed here. You, 
have an opinion here. So, so day six, Jay backs off. I don't know who I am. I don't know what I like to do. I don't know. I don't know. That was such a hard question. That was such a mind-boggling question. You know, you know what I mean? It, it kind of makes me mad too because it's like so many people it, it it makes me it makes me it makes me oh yo it's lynn what's up lynn um it makes me feel it makes me feel very very upset for someone when they act like someone they're not and you can tell you know you know those people that are like smiling but the smile is just super fucking fake like you can just tell and it makes me mad for them like who's done this to you to make you make you need to play this character that's not you you know what i mean anything happened no no nothing happened i'm just these were just thoughts that were in my head i couldn't sleep last night because of these you're allowed to be you? Okay, so the thing about that is that that should be the truth, but that it's not. It's not. You know, to make it in, uh, let's say for example, just, just for example, um, like hip hop in America. It's hard. I feel like it's really, really hard for you to make it. Well, I wouldn't know, but like just looking at it from a third person perspective from like outside the industry, because I don't know how, how the industry works over there. Like, hip hop in America, it would be really, really, really hard and rare to see someone that's like not hard or that isn't like, you know, there to play the game, there to play ball. You know, when people press them, like, if they back off every time, then I feel like it would, it would somehow make your, make your image harder to attract people who are real hip hop heads. You know what I mean? I don't know. I, I don't know what I'm fucking saying. I don't know. I'm just saying. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, it's hard. I'm just confused. Like, until when does this, does this like, does this facade and this, this playwriting have to keep going? And I'm like slowly transitioning over to America, and I had this conversation. Once again, for the people that weren't here, this all stemmed from a conversation with a friend. And they were like, what's your identity? You need a story. America is driven by stories. And I'm sitting here like, okay, I see that. I definitely see where you're coming from. I mean, I didn't say this to them, obviously, but I'm, I'm sitting here thinking like, I can't just be myself. <laughs> and I know, I know that's like the most cliche thing ever. Like, why can't I just be myself? I, I genuinely just want to be myself. I'm tired of having to think of a backstory and act towards a particular role of a narrative that I made in order to succeed in a I don't know, maybe it's because I don't I don't I don't like know the American industry. You know what I mean? Maybe it's different. Maybe it's different over there. Like even with my music. They explain this too in my music, and I guess that's just who I am. Um They they said they were going through all the music that I listened to and or the, all the music that i made and even for, particularly for my features they were all over the place in genre and for my features it would it wouldn't i wouldn't have a distinct sound but it would just sound like i was meshing towards the artist that sent me the song or whoever i was featuring for and that make that makes sense i thought i thought that's don't mind them no 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 i don't think they're bad people i think they're giving me genuinely good advice i'm just confused you know what I mean? So, so, like, you're right. I, I realize, yeah, you're right. Maybe I don't have a particular sound. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Like, I generally write my features to mesh well. The more organic they feel towards whoever I'm sending them to, the better it is. I don't I don't do things to stand out and be like, this is me. 
you know, like, I, well, I mean, obviously, I have to put points in, like, like, points of, points of recognition for people to be attracted to that verse, you know what I mean, or to that song, period. <laughs> but I don't, I don't go out there being like, I'm gonna bring my distinct color, it's a, it's a feature. You know what I mean? But I guess, I guess it kind of makes sense when they're talking about my music, too. Because if you listen to my music, all of my music, they're like different genres and I don't really have a... I don't really have like a specific niche or like a specific specific take, a specific sound that I go after. I don't know. So what do you guys think? Like what's what's my narrative? Like who am I? If you were me, What's my story? What do you think? But that makes it sound good, it flows well. So the thing is, yeah, that, that's my thing. If it always flows well, like I make sure that, you know, they might not pop off, but the first thing I do is I always make sure that it's okay by the artist. Cause e even if it's like newer artists, sometimes they're just like, oh, okay, that's cool. But like, I hate that. I absolutely hate that because I know what it feels like to release music that you're not okay with. And I hated that shit. Like, if, you, if you, it's the worst feeling in the world. And you just want to take it all back, but you can't because that's how the system works here. <laughs> but, it's like, I don't ever want someone to release a verse with me on it if they feel like it's not good enough. You know? It's like, that's number one. I get it okay by the artist for sure. Sometimes I can't tell if they're being nice or if they're if they're like actually like oh okay that's dope. That's a struggle point too. I sometimes can't tell. Y'all know I have my self esteem issues, so it's like I can't tell if they're being nice or not. I don't know. <laughs> For me, it's okay as you do whatever what you want. I mean, is that really okay though? Is that gonna is that gonna garner success for the people around you? It's like an endless loop. You know what I mean? It's an endless loop of questions. Like, we all know the age old question, like, oh, you should, like, are you allowed to be yourself? Of course, you're allowed to be yourself. You know. It's it's been it's been it's been questioned so many times at this point that it's cliche now, right? But is it really? It's not. That's not gonna get you paid. That's not gonna bring you respect. Sometimes, sometimes it will. You know. I don't know. I think you're doing well. <laughs> I appreciate that. I do. But, actually, there's no but to that. I just appreciate that. Thank you. The point is you feel great about what you do. But is, okay, so, so, think about this, right? You do, you think you've done the best job at your project. You've given that you're 110% at school, right? Or at, at work. Whatever. And then, your boss, or your, or your teacher, professor, whatever, they hand you back the report and they're like, this is, this sucks, this is ass. Do it again. What were you thinking? It's not good enough. Was it really good enough? You have to ask yourself that. Was, was it really good enough though? Maybe maybe it's cause maybe it's cause I'm someone that seeks validation from people that I respect. If I can't get that validation, for me it's not good enough. And I have to do it again. Until it's good enough. From your perspective it is. I guess that's true too. That's true too. From your perspective, it could be. So I feel like I feel like with my music, or at least like where I'm at, 
in my in my like surroundings i've gotten to a point where even people that want to tell me that my music isn't good out of ill intent or whatever like they can tell me it's not good but i mean it does numbers you can't deny that you know so so i'm past that now i'm past this whole like the whole k-pop scene now i'm, I'm thinking towards the future like I'm, I'm looking at i'm looking at america and the past scene there is it good enough for there you know what i mean have you been staying up late lately no nah, my sleep schedule is pretty good it's just this question has been driving me crazy it's such a deep question you know what i mean for me it depends the reason is being good enough must be stated for me to accept it exactly it has to be good enough for you to accept it but can can i accept i don't know maybe i'm just stupid i think i think it's just my lack of iq you know what i mean i'm just i'm just too dumb to comprehend this huge question it's so big you know what i mean Man, we talking about we talking about deep ass life questions. You guys are asking me what my tattoo is. Come on now. <laughs> anyway, I, I just wanted to like it's just food for thought. It's just food for thought. It's like, yeah, is it good enough? Is it good enough for me? I think so. Is it good enough for them? I don't know. If it's not good enough for them, is it really good enough for me? Will that make you happy in the space that you are? Will that give you success? If not, is that really good enough? You gotta think about it. You gotta really, really think about it. Yeah. If anyone has an answer to that, like an actual, actually good answer, hit me somewhere. Cause I'm, I'm curious. I'm like, I'm trying to think right now. I've been thinking for the past couple of days. I can't answer that question. Who am I? I don't know. Long questions. I'm sober, by the way. <laughs> In case you guys think I'm drunk or something, I'm not. This is just, this is just like, I'm just, yeah. Okay, anyway, um. Alright, bye.